Greetings everyone, future feature film director, the Rookie Critic here, and I have finally returned to continue making content and is about to start Season 5 of the Rookie Critic. Now, let's just jump right in to what you guys can expect to see on my channel. Kicking off this list, we've got the Rare Movie Reviews. This is where I try to review movies that I don't think that many people have seen. A couple examples of ones that I've done before is Deep in the Valley, Alien Planet, Tampopo, Ninjak vs. the Valley Universe, trying to bring you guys something that you guys haven't necessarily seen yet and are going to want to go check out. Next up, we've got comic book reviews, of which I'm still pretty much a gosh darn noob when it comes to comics, but I'm still going to be taking a look at them anyway. I think I'm going to call my comic reviews the Rook Takes a Look at a Comic Book Thing. Next up, we've got two. We've got the YouTuber Appreciations and the Actor Appreciations. This is where I pretty much take a look at my favorite YouTubers and give you reasons why you should go and check those people out. And for the actor appreciation, I'm just telling you some of my favorite actors and giving you some stats on them and some things about them that you guys might not have known. Moving on into the next type of video that I'm going to be making, and that is one of my favorites, and that is the film topics. Now this is where I'll be taking a look at some things like how certain aspects are important in film, that what's the difference between uh, film and theaters, which is better, streaming or discs? What are some of the best movie and TV series endings? How does seeing a movie trailer before you see the movie affect your experience watching the movie? And many more topics along those lines that are way too much for me to list. Now, <clears throat> another thing I'm going to be doing is looking at some short films and fan films. I've seen so many of them that are fantastic that I'm not sure how many other people are aware of them. So I'm going to be doing little tiny reviews slash shoutouts to some awesome short films and fan films that I've seen. I've already done a few already. Go ahead and check them out if you would like on the channel. Especially Power Rangers Unworthy. That one is freaking kick-ass. For many of you that know me, you know that I have not seen a bunch of classic movies that everyone else has. Like last year was the first time that I saw Alien, Die Hard, Rambo, Jaws, Kill Bill, all these classic movies. And I'm going to be bringing back the watch parties where you guys can watch my reactions to seeing them for the first time with a modern view and from a rookie's perspective. I'll be bringing on people that know quite a bit about those movies and love them big time so that I can have some actual more perspective and more information on them and the difference in the timing of when people saw them. And I'll also be trying to, after those watch parties, I'll put up little reviews of them as well. So if you don't want to see the entire two hour long watch party, you can settle in for a good, you know, 30 minute review probably. I don't know how long I'll do those ones, but we'll see. You can expect those as well. All right, we have reached the last category of videos that I shall make, and this is the one that I'm probably most known for, and that is my projects. Now, some of you guys are probably aware of my Rotten Tomatoes stop motion projects that I did with those characters last year, and my The Rookie's Quest trilogy, where I had a bunch of cameos from a bunch of different YouTubers and put everything that I learned up to that point to the test. Those type of projects will be returning. And I've already announced my The Rookies Legends project, and that had to be postponed quite a little bit. I've had to change up quite a few things, and some cast members had to do other stuff as well. But I'll be giving some updates on that very soon, as well as the one that's coming right after that. I'm going to be doing one right after The Rookies Legends as well. And you'll be seeing the tomatoes return, everybody. The stop-motion tomatoes will be back. I've got a bunch of ideas for that stuff. I'm going to get a lot more props for it. It's going to be a lot of fun. I've learned quite a bit about some extra stop motion stuff. I've learned more about filmmaking since then. So this will be pretty much me at the Rookie Critic learning how to become a future feature film director right before your eyes. I'm hoping to really grow and learn by doing this. Anyway, those are the long list of videos I'm going to be trying to make for my channel for season five of the Rookie Critic. And that's all I've got to say. We'll be putting out more videos soon, and have a great rest of your day.